Hello everyone and welcome to Solid Code. In this video we will see how to update the Heroku stack of your application. In this case I have three apps that are really old. These two right here and this one. You can see that they were uh, using the Heroku 16 stack. So we need to update them because otherwise the bills are going to stop working. So I'm going to show you how to do it. First of all I will do this one. This is an Node.js application. The app is still working in, in that Heroku instance, but I need to upgrade the stack, otherwise I won't be able to make changes. This app is really old as well. So for now, what I need is to just update the stack. I'm not going to worry about the project itself. So let's see how this is done. First of all, I'm going to create a specific branch just for this. In my case is Heroku stack upgrade and I will work on only this branch. I will leave the master branch without changes. So what I am going to do is to use this command. So Heroku create and I will use this stack Heroku 20 and Heroku 20. And here there is the name of my app. This is the name of my, my app. So I will use this command. So that name was too long, so I changed it to Sudoku app, Heroku 20. And this is already created. So let's see. So as you can see here, I went to that URL and here I have my app. And it says refer to the documentation if you need help deploying it. So now that's what we need to deploy the app. Before doing the deploy, it's important to know that if you have add-ons like, I don't know, ClearDB or any of the add-ons that Heroku has in your original application, you need to add them to this one. Also, for example, if you have certain configurations, you need to add them. I will put la the link in the description of the Heroku documentation for this migration of add-ons. But if you don't have any add-on, you don't have to worry. So we just need to do the deploy. In order to make the deploy successfully, you need two things. Since probably this is a really old application, you need to put in your engines the version of Node and NPM on which version, on which project was running right because otherwise it's not going to work that happened to me at the beginning and in order to deploy it you need for example in this case I'm using this uh, branch Heroku stack upgrade so you need to use git push and um, the stack of Heroku in this case is sunny and Heroku stack upgrade in this case this is my branch here would be your branch two points and master otherwise it's not going to work because otherwise will not do the the build that Heroku runs on the deploy so if I go here I see my app working and here I see that everything is working here I see the stack that is Heroku 20 and if I go to open app it will work. So now we know that with Heroku 20 we are not going to have issues. That is good. But we haven't migrated the original, right? The one with the issue. This one. So let's do that. I mean you could you are you solve the problem just with this, but in order to do not have duplicates, uh, we are going to try to um to fix the original. So let's do that. In this case, we just run the Heroku stack set, the Heroku 20 minus A, and the number of the original app in my case was this one, Shelter Citadel. Right? So that is okay. And finally, we need to run the following command. So it's the same one that we did last time. So let's run it. So it worked. I had to change a little bit the command because I had to use the force because there was some problems, probably other partner, yeah, other teammates, sorry, 
did a push recently, but I didn't know that. But uh, it was not doing anything. Maybe he was trying the same thing. Um, okay, so it worked. And now let's go to Heroku. And I can see now that this application, it has Heroku 20. That's great. And let's go here and open the app. And it is working. So that is great. Um, thanks for watching. You can use this tutorial for any stack upgrade on Heroku. That's great. And I really appreciate if you can subscribe and hit the like button. Thanks for watching and bye.